Hi everyone and welcome back to a new video. We're starting right away with a slip knot and 6mm crochet hook. So I'm gonna chain 3 and I will add 3, uh, sorry, do double crochet in the third chain from the hook. I'm gonna chain 2 and 3 double crochet in the same chain. I'm going to repeat two more times, chain two, three double crochet. Before I join, before I join to form a square. So using the first color, this is how we start the granny square and I'll be joining a different color for the second row. Adding the gray color, I'm going to chain three. and two double crochet in the same space as chain three. So the previous chain two spaces are the ones where we're gonna work the clusters now. Cluster which is three double crochet, chain two and three double crochet in all the spaces. So total of four spaces. Now adding the third color, again I'm going to repeat the same process, chain 3, 2 double crochet in the same space and now in the small spaces between the uh, previous 3 double crochet I'm going to make only 3 double crochet. So basically in the corners I'm going to make 3 double crochet, chain 2, 3 double crochet and in the small spaces I'm going to only make 3 double crochet throughout this row and I'm going to repeat the same with the fourth color until I get my final granny square.
So now total I should have five granny squares together and I'm gonna start joining them. So making sure the uh, crown piece is uh, the one which will work the uh, fourth corners. So I will attach one by one with a slip stitch in each side. So starting with the first one, I'm going to join the thread again and slip stitch in the back loop of each side. And again, I'm going to repeat throughout the crown granny square side for all four pieces to form the initial look of the hat. Now using a tapestry needle, I'm going to stitch all the open sides uh, left from the uh, initial joining and I'm going to stitch all the sides before I go to the next step to form the final look of the bucket hat. We're gonna make two rows. So single crochet in every stitch. Now after the two rounds of single crochet, now I'm going to start with chain one, two single crochet in one stitch, one single crochet in the next stitch for the entire round, two in one stitch, one in the next stitch. And the last one and join. Now for the next six rounds I'm gonna chain one and single crochet in every stitch only. So six rounds chain one and one single crochet in every stitch. I'll come back to show you the end results and this is the two last stitches before I fasten off and slip stitch this is the sixth round completed and we're done with the granny square bucket hat this is how it looks like you'll see it clearly in the picture but it's very easy and quick to do and it's fun with any color of your choice and you're ready for the summer i hope you find the tutorial easy to follow if you have any questions do not hesitate to leave it in the comment section until next time take care bye bye